How's it going everybody? Welcome back to the channel here and today we're going to talk about your sidebar is missing on your M1 MacBook Pro with macOS Monterey. At the same time, we will be showing you how you can customize your sidebar once you get them back on your MacBook Pro. Okay everybody, now if you open up your finder from here and then you'll be able to see there's no sidebar options available over here. Now, even if you drag your mouse, if you see nothing is coming up, then don't worry, okay? And if you want to just fix this problem, the first things you gotta do, just go ahead and click on here or you can just simply drag your mouse over here on top and then you'll be able to see this option called view. Click on there and here you have to down all the way to the show sidebar in water to get it back. Okay, click on here and then you'll be able to see your sidebar appears. Now the question is where are your other things like your favorite and others that you supposed to have over here. Now basically if you you know keep them hidden then you won't be able to see them unless you enable them once again from here. Now for example if I click the favorite on the arrow icon on here and then it's going to start showing you all the things that you used to have on your Mac. At the same time it happens to your locations and it happens to your tag as well. Now it seems like we have all the things back here on our M1 Mac. Okay everybody, now let's talk about the customizations of your sidebar. Now let's say there are some things that you wanna add or something that you wanna don't use. Well, now let's say you don't need to use your desktop folder from here from your sidebar. Then all you can do, you can delete it from here. Now to delete it, just go ahead and drag it and leave it over here and then your desktop will be gone or anything that you don't wanna use from here will be gone. Now, if you wanna quickly add them back right here, anything that is important for you, you need to head over to your Macintosh. From here, you'll be able to find out all those important things that you need. Now you can pick up any application that you want or you can add anything like library system and user. So let's say you wanna add your library here. So all you have to to just go ahead and click on your library, leave it over here, and there you are. Your library will be added right here. So in the same way, you can add or remove anything in water to customize your sidebar, and this is how you can do it. Hope you find this video useful. If so, drop a like and subscribe to the channel to get more useful video content for yourself. Thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you later.